Dozens of people have voiced their frustrations about public transport at a forum organised by the LNP. From the big picture to small battles, residents say they're finding it hard to be heard by the bureaucrats. Margaret Murphy's getting a bus stop in her front yard, which would be handy if she caught the bus. Basically, we've been bullied. It's been generic, standard letters to all the residents. While Margaret agrees the services are needed, just metres down Millwall Drive is a public park. She says this is the ideal place for the stop. The council services the area where the infrastructure is already there, seats, bins, lighting. She says bureaucrats don't listen and it seems others agree. Last night there was a traffic jam at the door as more than 100 people attended a public transport forum in Kiwana. Been to the council, we've been to the police and we're getting nowhere. Jared Blay hosted the event. The LNP says Sunshine Coast public transport is going nowhere and that $20 million of changes to the Sunshine Coast train services are a perfect example of botched government policy. What it gave to the Sunshine Coast for many of those people is a worse service. For many people who are already on that train for a very long time in the morning, it actually made that journey even longer. But for Margaret, the most frustrating example is much closer to home. If you consulted with the residents, you would have a better service. Amelia Brace, 7 News.